it's your girl Candice Renee and I'm back with another video and today today as you seen by the title I'm going to be comparing two different products same brand but two different lines let's just get right into the video but before we do make sure to like comment and subscribe you already know the drill and let's just get started first pair of products I'll be using are the my L pomegranate and honey I'll be using this on one side and I'll be comparing it to the Hawaiian ginger line. I'm just going to be doing a twist out today. First thing I always do is apply coconut oil to my hair. So I'm going to do that and then I'll be back. Okay, so I have the coconut oil in my hair. What I'm going to do is I'll pump out both leave-in conditioners and show you guys the consistency of both and talk about that. This is what it looks like. This one. And then this is the pomegranate and honey. Now, I personally feel like the Hawaiian ginger leave-in is thicker. You see that? I'm gonna be doing one side pomegranate and honey, one side Hawaiian ginger. Let's start off with this side. We'll go with the pomegranate and honey. As far as smell, um, I like the, the pomegranate and honey. I like the smell of that one more. I mean, they both smell really good, but the Hawaiian ginger is definitely stronger. And I don't like scents that are too strong, but it still smells good. The pomegranate and honey smells fruity and the Hawaiian ginger smells like a men's cologne. Let's see, as far as slip, hmm. They're both, they both have pretty good slip. Pomegranate and honey may have a little bit more slip, but they both still have a good amount. I feel like the Hawaiian ginger leave-in defines my curls more than the pomegranate and honey because this one has more hold to it, I feel like. Let's go ahead and compare these hair butters. Now with the hair butter and twisting souffle, in this case, the hair butter is um, not as thick as the twisting souffle. So with the leave-in, the Hawaiian ginger leave-in was thicker than the pomegranate and honey. And for the butters, um, the pomegranate and honey is thicker than the Hawaiian ginger. As you see, it's kind of like spilling out, or it was. And this isn't going anywhere. Let me just take some on my finger so you can see. So this is what the Hawaiian ginger looks like oh my gosh this lighting come on come on come on come on light this is what the hawaiian ginger looks like i'm sorry if the lighting is bad and this is what the pomegranate and honey looks like good amount of slip still and this i feel like this um twisting souffle is more defining well let's see let me not say that yet that's what that size looks like. So this is the side with the hair butter. As far as butters, yeah, the pomegranate and honey one is more defining, but in this case, I really don't care about that just because I'm doing a twist out. If I was doing a wash and go, then I'll be more concerned. Now we're just gonna go ahead and twist up my hair and a little bit of water gonna go ahead and finish twisting my hair and I'll come back to show you the twists how they're looking all right so I'm done with my twist I don't even know how long it took I don't know two hours later I don't know so this is the pomegranate and honey side this is the um, Hawaiian ginger side 
I three strand twisted in the front right here and I did one piece over here. I just like to do that at the top sometimes just so it's more defined. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Let's just go ahead and start unraveling these twists and let's see which side turned out better. Let's let's compare, let's see the difference of each side. I'm gonna take my TGIN um, oil and just rub a little of that in my hands and you know, y'all already know how it go. Let's go ahead and separate and see how separating is. Now, when it came to separating, the only difference I saw was the pomegranate and honey side was a little more, a little easier to separate my hair versus this side. This side wasn't necessarily hard. It was just, you could tell a slight difference. Like here, I could just pull all my hair and it just easily just came apart. Here, when I got to my ends, it was only in the sections where my hair my pattern, my curl pattern is tighter because in the back where it's looser, it was like this side. As far as shine, there for both. Definition, there for both. Moisture, there for both. That's the main things I care about when it comes to products. The only differences I saw, like I said, was when it came to separating and the smell. Because this side, I definitely could smell more than the pomegranate and honey. Now I'm just going to go ahead and fluff Fluff, fluff, fluff. Where's my pick? Oh, there it is. First of all, this middle part ain't it. I want it to be more flat like this, but my roots keep doing this. I'm like, ooh, like, no, go do. I was planning on wearing a headband anyway, so I'll probably just gel this down and put a headband on, do my edges. We're not gonna do that in this video, actually, because it's just unnecessary. It's gonna take too much time, and yeah. That's not what you guys came for. Out of, out of 10, I give both of these products a 10 out of 10 because that's just how much I love my L. You know what I'm saying? They always come through for me. They always have, they've always worked for me. I know different products work for different people, but these right here, these have saved my life literally because if you guys don't know back then, like what was it? Almost two years ago, I think. My hair was acting just dumb, stupid, dumb, dumb, retarded and nothing was working for it. I used to use Cantu, you know, the whole thing. They changed the formula. I believe they did because it just stopped working for me all of a sudden. I was just searching, searching for products and then they came out with that line right on time. At first I was like, I'm not, I'm not buying these products. Like it was a little on the expensive side. I was only used to spending like four to five to six dollars on products and their products are double that, but definitely worth the buy. I'm so happy I did try them out because they have been working for me ever since. So shout out to you guys. Thank you. Just shout out my hair wouldn't know what to do without you guys, okay? So anyways, 
<laughs> let me calm down that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did you already know what to do and then until the next video love you